moved here before the coup. Is that right? That, yeah, correct. Okay, so um, since then, are you hearing that anyone who has been fired or, you know, the civil servants, the journalists who have not been arrested, anyone's able to get out of Turkey or has everyone been stopped from leaving? I mean, uh, critical journalists, uh, most of them, uh, passports are revoked. Okay. So they are trapped. Either they are in jail or they are hiding in the country. So this is, this, these are the two options. And uh, the editor-in-chief of a leftist newspaper is in exile in Germany, for instance. But he left, uh, I mean, in a very critical time before his passport was revoked, not revoked. But his wife decided to accompany him in Germany, but she was not permitted. Uh. Yes. She was declined in the, in the airport. And now, he's not as lucky as me. Now I'm, I'm together with my family at least. I, I have one other um, question. You, you talked about the steps that happened before Erdogan took over the news, your newspaper. Um, you, the things that you said were putting down the journalist personally, criticizing the newspaper, trying to stir up people to dislike it, going to advertisers. Um, you know, it sounds like, a, and not letting your reporters go to press conferences. We have seen some of that in this country. <laughs> I, I'm just curious. This is, this is your uh, politics. Why do you think, <laughs> why, I mean, how, why do you think that our country is not in danger of going the same path that Erdogan has taken Turkey? Uh, I, I think all Democrats should always be concerned and not take your rights and freedoms granted. So this is my note. Okay. And democracy requires a continuous struggle to preserve them, to deserve them, to deserve those rights. So when I saw that the CNN reporter, and when Mr. Trump was querying with the CNN reporter, I, I don't remember his name now, it was kind of deja vu for me. <laughs> so I said, oh, uh, we left Turkey because of oppression and persecution, and we are in America, with the hoping that this is a real democracy. And look what's happening. It was a very really bad feeling for me. Mm -hmm. And next step, there was, uh, I mean, some reporters, including CNN, I guess, were uh, not prevented to press conference. Aha, I said this is the second step. <laughs> so steps are coming. But there, there has been good things that uh, makes America different than, than Turkey. When uh, there was quarrel between Mr. Trump and this journalist, the, in the evening, I saw, I watched Fox News, I mean, which supports more Trump than Democrats, right. uh, apparently. And there was a colleague from Fox News supporting CNN reporters.